So I'm a homeowner and I own a property and I see my neighbor is having a lot of, has a lot of termite damage. The, the, they're there doing some repairs yeah. and I'm just really nervous. Does that mean that I'm gonna have termites also? Yeah, in the, um, it's hard because it, a lot of it depends on the area that you live. And so if you're in an area that's got a bunch of older trees, like I was saying earlier, then yes, you might want to have an inspector come out and at least take a look and, you know, call the company. I just want you guys to look for termites. I'm not selling my house. I don't need a full report. We'll come out for free. We'll take a look to make sure you have nothing. Um, the, what's really nice is the chemical in the past used to be like they put a barrier around the neighbor's house mm -hmm. and you could, you would, the termites that were at your neighbor's house could literally just, now they're going to come to your house because your neighbor has a barrier. Right now there's a, a chemical out there called Termidor that pretty much every company has switched to and it's a non-repellent so the termites don't know they're going through that and it's actually killing that colony. So where before they put the barrier around the house, now there might be, I've even heard of cases where there's a termite colony in between two homes. The neighbors are having more of a problem with that colony. They call a company out, the company sprays Termidor down, and now it's treated both homes. It's killed that actual colony. So no, you don't need to be nearly as worried now when your neighbors have termites and they're getting a treatment. It, those termites aren't coming to, to your house anymore. They're killing those termites there. But it is a good idea to have a, a company come out if you see your neighbors having a problem. Have them come out, take a look at your house. Okay, and is there th some things I can do to prevent the termites from coming to my house? Yeah, there's definitely some things you can prevent as far as the moisture around the house, the water and stuff. Um, having the every other every other year having an inspection and uh, and looking for. I mean, it's really it's a it's a subterranean termites. They build a little tiny dirt tube up the foundation wall. Um, they come up there's if you live on a slab foundation, they have the, there's voids in the concrete slab, and so termites will come up through those voids and stuff. So. Um, Underneath sinks a lot of times, you know, I tell people, move some of the stuff underneath your sink and just look on that back wall. Sometimes you'll see termites and tubes coming up. So really pay attention to, you know, the once every six months when you're doing that, or once a quarter when you're doing that deep cleaning, mm -hmm. look around the house and see if you see anything that seems kind of weird. Hey, there's some dirt on my windowsill, and it looks like there's a little tube of dirt. Call a company out. Don't just, oh, let me clean that up, and it's going to go away. So you'll come out once a year for free and check my home? Yeah, so ba I mean, it's basically if someone calls our company, and most companies will do that, and just say, I don't need a full inspection, I just, my neighbors, we have termite problems, my neighbors have them, can you guys come out and just look, it's a limited report, you know, we'll come out and just make sure you guys don't have termite